Setting up company-wide automatic email signatures doesn't have to be a challenge. Let me show you how it's done. I'll start by creating a new rule for Outlook signatures. Let's create a simple signature for internal emails. Next up, I need to decide which users should get the signature. Let's add all senders here. Now I can decide if I want to add the signature based on who gets my email. Let's select internal recipients here. Later on, I'll create another signature for external emails. Next up is the scheduler. I want my signature to be active all the time, so let's leave it off and move next. So now I'm going to set up my signature as default for new messages and also for replies and forwards. And now let's finally design the signature by clicking here. Let's use a template. This one looks nice for a full marketing signature, but I want a simple one, so I'm going to remove some elements. Okay, perfect. So now let's replace my logo here by uploading a new one. By the way, it will be embedded, so it will always show up in the email app. And now let's update the logo link here. Now let's preview the signature for different people in my company by choosing them here. As you can see, the signature always shows up to date contact details of the sender. All looking good, so let's apply this design. So the last step is to save my automated signature. It's now live in my company, but before I show it to you, I'll go ahead and create a bigger marketing signature for external emails only. Again, let's add all senders here and move on. The signature I created before works for internal emails, so for this one, I'll select external recipients. And it will be added if at least one recipient is external. Let's skip the scheduler. The logic step is also the same as before, so I'm going to select to add this signature to new messages, but also to replies and forwards. I'll show this live in a sec. So let's design the marketing signature. I'm going to select the same layout as before, but this time I'm going to keep the user photo, marketing banner, and disclaimer. Let's fast forward a bit while I update some stuff. Okay, I got a nice full design here, so let's publish it and see these two signatures in action. So I'm going to start typing an email on my phone. And boom, my new simple signature is automatically inserted. So let's type an internal address. Nothing changes, so it works the way I want it to. But when I add an external recipient, see what happens. The signature automatically changes to my full marketing design because I'm sending externally right now. Pretty cool, right? And the best thing is people in my company don't have to do a thing. It's all up and running for them automatically. And what about computers? Well, it all works the same, but it's even more flexible. When I type an email, I can open the signature add-in pane and insert other signature designs available to me if I need to. Works like a charm, always.